Hello, it's Patrick here from the GarageBandGuide.com. Parallel compression is something that we GarageBand for Mac users just don't have access to. iHeart New York, the debut audio plugin from New York-based developers Baby Audio, aims to deliver all the punch and power of a fully featured parallel compressor in a straightforward and easy to use interface. In this video, I'll take a closer look and let you know if you should consider adding iHeart New York to your GarageBand plugin arsenal. Okay, okay, a few provisos before we dive in here. If you're aware of what parallel compression is, then skip forward to the timestamp displayed on the screen to avoid a long-winded explanation by moi. Okay, so we don't have access to a parallel compression plugin in GarageBand as standard. As Baby Audio explain on their website, parallel compression, the traditional way, means setting up a separate bus sending your audio to it, crushing it hard, then blending it back in with your signal. It also means having to balance an extra fader for the remainder of your mix. You're probably aware that GarageBand on Mac doesn't feature a mix bus in any shape or form, so no parallel compression. What's great about iHeart New York is that the plugin itself hosts a parallel track internally. No mix bus required here. I love the way this plugin looks. I know looks really don't matter, especially when it comes to audio plugins, but the extra mile baby audio have went to here really helps set it apart. Compression traditionally isn't the most exciting effect out there after all. Interface wise, you have an input meter on the left, two knobs, a slider and a solo button in the middle, and an output meter on the right. The spank knob is where the magic happens here. Baby Audio say that it controls a complex algorithm designed to fire up anything that you throw at it. Specifically, you're getting a mix of high ratio compression with a transient friendly envelope and a bit of EQ combined with a low end preservation filter applied to the internal detection signal for a fuller sound. The parallel signal slider dictates how much of the affected or spanked signal will come out of the other end and the output knob gives you control over the volume of the outgoing signal. Baby Audio are keen to point out that clicking that solo button beneath the parallel signal slider results in iHeart New York acting as a more traditional compressor by muting the dry audio signal and this thing does function really well as a normal compressor too, albeit one with tons of personality. Enough talk, let's have a listen to how iHeart New York sounds when applied to a variety of different track types. Circles, I'm getting dizzier. The more you spin me around, watch me hit the ground. Round the circles, I'm getting dizzier. Watch me. 
hit the ground Round the circles, I'm getting dizzier The more you spin me around Watch me hit the ground Round the circles, I'm getting dizzier So Baby Audio's I Love New York, it obviously sounds pretty bloody fantastic. Top marks then? Well, that'll depend on you really. If you're the type of person who needs to have absolute control over every aspect of your effects chain, if you can't bear the thought of relinquishing control of some of the fine tuning when it comes to compression, then I Heart New York is definitely 
not for you. This plugin isn't going to give close to the level of control that you're probably looking for. If, however, you're happy to take a little more of a hands-off approach when it comes to the particulars of how your track signal is being affected and have the results be really bloody cool sending, then I'd absolutely recommend giving iHeart New York a go. As a wee aside here, and being completely honest, when companies are kind enough to send me copies of their products to review, it's fairly rare that that product ends up becoming part of my everyday music production workflow. I generally get stuck into that product for a week or more, get to grips with its features, write or film a review, and then move on to the next video, article or review iHeart New York is one of those rare special products that I find myself going back to time and time again in my own projects because it makes it seriously easy to add some personality and extra oomph to a track or a whole mix. I had a version of this review ready to go weeks ago but I wanted to spend a little bit of extra time with this plugin because I really did think that it was something a little bit special and I'm really glad that I took that extra time to get to know it because it is banging. It's pretty crazy to think that this is Baby Audio's first foray into the world of audio plugins and really I can't wait to see what they cook up next. iHeart New York is available for $29 from Baby Audio's website. There's also a free trial available, so no excuses. Go and check it out. Links are down in the description. I've been Patrick from thegaragebandguide.com and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.